I'm Pat Whitworth. I'm a surgical oncologist, now a breast surgical oncologist in Nashville, Tennessee. And we are at the American Society of Breast Surgeons meeting where on Saturday I'll be presenting results from our in-breast registry. The in-breast registry is a, is a registry for patients who are getting preoperative chemotherapy for breast cancer. And at least it's for patients who, where we're considering preoperative chemotherapy for breast cancer. In the in-breast registry, we are using a multi-gene classifier, the Blueprint 80-gene assay. It's a subtyping assay to help select patients for preoperative chemotherapy. In fact, the registry is comparing that assay to conventional means for selecting patients. The in-breast registry directly compares our conventional subtyping using IHC and FISH to an 80-gene multi-gene classifier blueprint subtyping assay in order to predict which patients will respond to preoperative chemotherapy. What we found was that the multi-gene classifier much better predicted which patients would respond. In fact, it reassigned about one in five patients to a different category and those categories were much more predictive of the patient's outcome. We think this is important because it is important to properly select patients for preoperative chemotherapy. And our findings suggest that conventional subtyping with IHC and FISH doesn't get it right as much as we would like. In fact, the ADGene Blueprint subtyping assay reassigns patients. In fact, it reassigns about one in five luminal patients to the basal category and it reassigns a significant number of HER2 positive patients to the luminal category and those patients really didn't respond to preoperative treatment. 